Neuroscience at its very basic level, I guess, is the scientific study of the nervous system. And uh, here in UCD, we give you a full training uh, and understanding of the broader nervous system, which includes the many different parts so the brain that controls many of the complex functions of our body and the peripheral nervous system through our eyes and ears and nose, etc., where we sense the outside world. So we try to give students, you know, the full spectrum, the full gamut of the topic. Being a neuroscience student at UCD is really, really interesting and I find it really enriching that almost every day I'm learning new things about the brain and it's great. My favourite part is that our professors and our lecturers are doing their own research so they can come in and present to us their own uh, findings and what they're even working on. And it's, it's really fun to be kind of so close to, to everything new that's being discovered. Neuroscience degree is nearly 20 years old here in UCD. So I think students coming in, they should know that you know, ha they have a highly thought through uh, a neuroscience program covering what we think are all the important elements. So we also have a great teaching staff. We also have some additionally unique aspects around, for example, our final year undergraduate projects. So every student has the opportunity to do a 10 week project in the lab. It's highly involving for the staff members. Students come into our labs and we'll basically do experimentation for 10 weeks. I think that's really unique. We get the students to write up their material as a thesis, and they really learn what it's like to actually do experimentation, how to analyze actual new data, their data, and, and ultimately interpret that data. And I guess that gives them a sense of discovery. And ultimately, if, if a student can graduate with that sense that we know we've achieved uh, here in UCD, we're putting them out into the place, workplace as a burgeoning scientist. One thing I really liked about the common entry system was that I got to meet other students from um, the other sciences. And I also really liked the fact that we can get a bit of background and taste other modules, for example, like genetics, and um, kind of relate that back to neuroscience or pharmacology. And I could um, have a better understanding of neuroscience from those aspects. So when students come into UCD in years one and two, they're basically preparing for the neuroscience experience. So those first two years are extremely important because in those years, the students gain all the fundamentals, many different aspects of biology, some aspects of chemistry, a little bit of physics, maybe in the case of neuroscience, some mathematics in the case of statistics. Uh, but that's all preparing the students in years one and two for the full program. Now in year two, Neuroscience also runs a Principles of Neuroscience module, so the students can really see early on if this is the type of subject they want to study. So the students will learn a lot of core neuroscience from the point of view of cell biology, the molecules involved, and how disease is implemented. We also teach students in year three the importance of drug interactions, because of course, we're always trying to think about curing uh, neurological disorders. And then in fourth year, it's really just a, an advanced version of third year. And so taking everything you've learned in third year, we then apply that to these advanced courses where students interrogate in large part the published literature actually. So they're getting exposed to the very latest discoveries. And there's a lot of reflection on what those discoveries are telling us about neuroscience, telling us about the direction of the subject and the topic and what we can hope for the future. So the schedule each week is actually way more relaxed than I, than I thought it would be. Um, usually around about 15 to 20 hours of lectures and labs and some tutorials as well, um, which is really good. You have the time to relax and, you know, to get immersed in the social aspect of, of college. In neuroscience, we're quite lucky to have some really great work placements for students. So for example, we have uh, an affiliation with the Max Planck uh, Institute in Germany, where students can go and conduct their fourth year projects as part of the Erasmus program and really do high-end research, which is directed at trying to understand the nervous system in the mouse brain. So many of our graduates um, end up working in the pharmaceutical industry 
in drug development, for example, because of course they develop these great analytical skills in the lab and have a good understanding of the biological basis of the very things that these industries are trying to solve. Uh, also, our graduates go to clinical research settings, for example, hospital labs, or even forensics, again, taking advantage of the type of chemical knowledge that they have from their practical courses. We also have graduates who enter uh, science communication, things like patenting, some of the legal aspects. And of course, our graduates, quite a number, end up doing graduate research, so masters or PhD programs, which can set them on the track of becoming professors themselves in, in their later life.